Good night. Hey, good night. Welcome to the class. Welcome. Same. Good night, teacher. Good night. Is everything good today? Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. How are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. Nice to hear that. Nice to hear that. It is, it is always nice to hear that everybody is good. Okay? It's always nice. Oh, I'm feeling good tonight. I'm feeling really good. Okay. We, need, we need to finish section number two and we start section number three tonight, okay? So that's why I'm feeling really, really good. Okay. So, welcome to my class, Flor, Karma, Noé, Sofia, Jose, Ángel, Marisa, Yanira, Susan, Rocío, Alicia, Félix. Very welcome. Bienvenidos. Very welcome to my class, okay? So, without anything, let's begin. Let's begin. Um, ¿Alguien tiene la, la radio o el televisor muy fuerte, muy fuerte? Thank you very much. Okay, let's go. Let's see over here. Ooh. My bad. What is that the thing? Let me see, let me see. Oh, here it is. Uh, do you remember what we did yesterday? ¿Se recuerdan dónde nos quedamos ayer? Lecture 2.12. 2.12. Very good. Thank you very much. 12. This one, yeah. Eh, ¿Nos quedamos al inicio o ya lo habíamos hecho todo? Inicio. Ok, very good. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Ok, so we are, uh, we are hitting 2.12 achievement indicator. In this lesson, participants will read an article about jobs and in order to practice their reading comprehension for specific information, some questions are asked. Everybody? Everybody reading, please? No, I don't leer. The screen is in. Wait, 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 wait. So the screen is in here. My bad, my bad. To me, to me, to me. <laughs> my bad. Sorry, I need to um, share it with you. And I was like all excited. Just having. Okay, there you go. <laughs> my bad, my bad. Ya lo pueden ver. Yes. Yes, teacher. <laughs> Okay, good. So let's see. 2.12 achievement indicator. In this lesson, participants will read an article about jobs. And in order to practice their reading comprehension for specific information, some questions are asked. Everybody. In this, in this lesson, lesson, participants will read an article about jobs in order to practice for specific information. Some questions are asking. Ask. 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 No questions. Very good. Okay, let's go. Okay, number one. What do you do in your free time? 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 Wait, 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 wait. Déjenme ver algo. Me parece una que ya leí. Wait, let me see something. Algo no cuadra. Eso fue en la presentación de cada uno. Mm. Esa parte. Oh, yeah. Sí, sí, sí. It's my bad. Es mi... Yo estaba mal. Ahí. Let me see. Don't save. Wait up, guys. Let me open the other one. Sorry, my bad. Oh, ¿qué hice la otra? Uh, here he is. Right. <laughs> the leak. Here we go. Here we go. Esta es. We had a great time. Es que cerré la otra por, por equivocación. 
what my mistake my mistake sorry my bad my bad so i'll come back again Oh, here it is. Ahora sí. <laughs> I know this magic is true. Everybody can see? ¿Todos lo pueden ver? Intermedio. Bye. Yes. Ok, hoy sí. Oh, my bad. Que tenía el de intermedio uno. Era la clase anterior. Sorry. So let's see. Todo esto ya lo vimos. Yeah. Ya lo vimos, ya vimos. Aquí, esto. Esto ya lo vimos, sí. Yeah. Esta. The Pass of B. El pasado yes. de B, ya. Yeah. Entonces vimos el... el Nos quedamos next, en la 2.12. 2.12. 2.12. 2.12. 2.12. Oh, aquí está. Ahí está. Next. Here it is. Sorry, my bad. Ok. 12.12. 2.12. Achievement indicator. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation and will be introduced to comparisons with adjectives by expressing preferences. Everybody? In this In lesson, participants conversation will be introduced to comparison with expressing preferences. By expressing preferences. Comparisons. Comparisons, comparisons with adjectives be expressing by, by expressing by expressing preferences preferences good thank you okay so en esta ocasión vamos a ver comparaciones y utilizando okay so let's go where did you go after school where did you go, did you Where go, did you go after, after school? Where did you go 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 after school? I went home after school. I went home after school. We went to the park. We went to the park. We, we went, went to, the park. Went to the, park. the park. We went to the park. Where did Mary go after school? Where did, Where did Mary, Mary go, after go after school? school? Where did Mary go after school? She went to her friend's house. She went, she went to, to her, her friend's, friend's house. house. Did Juan enjoy his lunch? Did Juan enjoy, enjoy his, his, his lunch? lunch? His lunch. Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Yes, he, yes, he, did. he did. No, he didn't. He didn't. No, he didn't. Did you enjoy dessert at the restaurant? Did, Did you, you enjoy, enjoy dessert, dessert at the restaurant? At the restaurant? At the restaurant? Yes, I did. It was delicious. Yes, yes I, I did. did. It was delicious. It was delicious. No, I didn't. It wasn't sweet enough. No, I didn't. It wasn't sweet enough. No, I didn't. It wasn't sweet enough. No, I didn't. Sweet enough. 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 No. Enough. Any questions here? Alguna pregunta acá? No. No question. Nadie? Cool. Okay, let's move on. Um, Leticia, where did you go after school? Leticia, where did you go after school? I went home after school. We went to the park. Very good. Ask Ma Marixa. Leticia, ask Marixa. Where did you go after school? Oh, my bad, my bad. She went to her friend's house. 
Okay, as um, Fabricio. Fabricio, did Juan enjoy his lunch? Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Thank you, a Sofia. Sofia, did you enjoy the dessert at the restaurant? Sofia, did you enjoy dessert at the restaurant? Yeah. Yes, I did. It was delicious. No, I didn't. I wasn't sweet enough. 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 Now. Enough. Enough. Como que termina con doble F. Enough. 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 Okay. Very good. Sofia, Enough. ask the net. Yes. Where did you go after school? Ninette, where do you go after school? Sorry, sorry. I went home after school. We went to the park. Very good. As Felix. Felix, did you enjoy dessert at the restaurant? Yes, I did. It was delicious. No, I didn't. It wasn't sweet enough. As Angel. Angel, where did you go after school? I went home after our school. We went to the park. Ask Marixa. Marixa, where did Mary go after school? She went to her friend's house. Ask Rocio. Rocio, did Juan enjoy his lunch? Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Ask Lisette. Lisette, did you enjoy dessert at the restaurant? Yes, I did. It was delicious. No, I didn't eat. It wasn't as sweet enough. As Janira. Janira, where did you go after school? I went home after school. We went to the park. As Noé. Noé, where did Mary go after school? She went to her friend's house. As Carla. Carla, did you Juan enjoy his lunch? Carla, did I Juan can hear lunch? you. Carla, did, did Juan enjoy his lunch? Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Thank you. Ask Flor. Flor, did you enjoy the dessert on the restaurant? No floor. No. Okay, Reina, did you enjoy the dessert at the restaurant? Yes, I did. It was delicious. No, I didn't. It wasn't sweet enough. Good. As Maudi. Maudi, where did you go after school? I went home after school. We went to the park. Ask Carlos, Carlos René. Carlos, where did Mary go after school? She went to her friend's house. Friends. She went to her friend's Friend. house. Friend's house. Very she good. went to her friend's house. No se me olvidó preguntarle a nadie? Good. Okay, continuemos then. Um, let's see what we have next. Ooh, we have the grammar. Tenemos la parte de la gramática. Let's go. Comparative adjectives. We're going to learn about comparative adjectives. Estos van a ser los adjetivos comparativos. Let's see. Okay. Quien comenzamos a leer. Ninette, can you read this, please? Okay. Comparative adjectives are used to compare difference between differences. The two differences. Differences between the two objects. The modif modify. Larger, smaller, faster, higher, higher. They are used in sentences where two nouns are compared. In this partner, noun, subject, plus verb, plus comparative, adjective, plus noun, plus no object. Good, good. Thank you very much. Um, okay. Remember that when you see, when you see um, a verb that ends in ed, Cuando veamos un verbo que termine en ed, eh, tratemos de hacer la, la, la pronunciación como t. Used, used, eh, compared, 
compared. Okay? Um, Flor, next. Noun, subject, plus verb, plus comparative adjective, plus them, plus noun, objective. The second item of comparison, 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 comparison. comparison can be omitted, omitted, omitted. omitted if it is clear from the context. Final ex, ex, example, example below. Examples. My house was large. Larger, than here. larger, larger. Larger. Larger, but sorry, and hairs. The box, box was smaller than the one I lost. Your dog ran faster than Lynn's dog. The rock flew, flew bigger, higher, than higher, rock, higher, higher than the rock. Jim and Jack were both my friends but i like it i like it i liked like i liked i liked uh, jack better very good thank you very much so these are the examples estos son ejemplos de cómo vamos a utilizar el sujeto y el verbo en este caso sujeto my y el verbo was en este en el pasado pero además que el comparativo es larger smaller faster higher Okay, any questions? Preguntas? No. Uh, the correct pronoun is higher. Higher, higher. Yes, higher. Any other question? Otra pregunta? No, we're good. Okay, moving on. Okay, who's next? Angel, uh, can you read this, please? Okay, teacher, okay. <laughs> Share my screen. Okay. Okay. <laughs> One syllable adjective. <laughs> and it are for the comparative. If the adjective have a consonant plus single vowel, plus consonant spelling, the final consonant must be double before it adding the adding. Adjective, tall, fat, big, sad. Comparative, taller, fatter, bigger, sad. Good. So remember that um, the thing is, eh, esta es la regla de cómo, de cómo lo vamos a uh, tener. Dice, single plus vowel plus consonant spelling. The final consonant must be double before adding the end. Cuando hay una letra doble, entonces no hay problema. Pero cuando solo hay una letra, por ejemplo, se le agrega una doble, una otra, otra T, por ejemplo. Doble G, doble D. ¿Ok? Questions? Preguntas? No. Very good. Siempre es así. Siempre es así. No, no, no. Ojo, esta es la primera regla. Que la regla dice que es de una sílaba. Adjetivos de una sílaba. Mire, tall, fat, bigger. Una sílaba. Entonces, ¿qué es la regla? Que si, que si esta, la regla, eh, si, la, si la regla termina en consonante, no hay problema. Pero si termina en, 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 una, en una vocal, entonces ahí se le agrega el, el, el doble. ¿Okay? Esta es la primera regla, one syllable, porque son, es una sílaba. ¿Okay? Vamos con la siguiente. Three or more syllables, y aquí ya, ya aumenta. Eh, ¿quién va? Quiero ver. Eh, Félix, can you read this please? Okay. Three or more syllable. Adjectives with three, three or more syllables for the comparative by putting more in front of the adjective. Expensive, expensive, comparative, more important, more expensive. Expensive. Okay, good. So look. Three syllables, important, expensive. So, hay tres sílabas ahí. Entonces, la regla dice que si hay tres sílabas o más, tenemos que anteponer more. Ojo, 
pero tienen que prepararse para contar si son tres sílabas o no. In, for, ten. Ex, pen, sieve. Tres sílabas. ¿Ok? ¿Entendimos? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Thank you. Quiero que quede bien claro antes de que nos movamos a algo, porque me gusta que lo sepan al 100%, ¿ok? Sí, ojo, si tienen una duda, si tienen duda, pregúntenme, please. No se vayan a casita con esa duda. Digo, ya están en casa. <risa> um, no se vayan a acostar con alguna duda, please. Ok, let's go. Teacher, teacher. ¿Ya? I have a question. Fíjese, bueno, lo voy a decir en español. Fíjese que yo he oído que dicen important y otro dicen important. What is the correct pronounce? ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo? No entendí. Eh, fíjese, yo he oído, bueno, dos palabras como la mencionan, important e important. ¿Cuál es la correcta? Buena pregunta. So, um, uh, you know that I study in the United States. Yo estudié en, en Estados Unidos. Y por mis estudios tuve que andar en todos Estados Unidos. De hecho, hasta fuera de ahí. Pero la cosa es que dependiendo del estado en que esté o de la parte de Estados Unidos en que esté, usted va a escuchar a algunos gringos decir important, important. Pero eso es más al norte, como de Pensilvania para abajo. Ya para el, el, el sur, que, que viene hacia abajo, eh, digamos eh, Denver, Colorado, Texas, California, important. So, entonces, ahí va a depender del gringo de donde sea. Pero sí, se usa, te dice important or important. So, las dos son válidas. Okay. Buena pregunta. Um, continuemos. Ok, irregular comparatives. Let's see, ¿quién va después? Let me check. Uh, Ninette, no. Carlos, Carlos, René. No? Okay, Leticia, can you read this, please? Okay. Irregular comparatives. This very common adjective have a completely irregular comparative forms. Adjective good, bad, little, much, far. Comparative better, worse, less, more, uh, farer, uh, further, and farer. Okay, good. Como verán, irregular, sigue irregular. Y sigue como los verbos que no tienen una regla específica. Entonces, lo mismo es con los comparativos. Ejemplo, good, better, bad, worse. Totalmente diferente de, del adjetivo. ¿Ok? Little, less, much, more. Far, tiene dos comparativos. Puede ser further, further, or farther. Ojo, ojo. Las dos son, eh, eh, uh, son válidas. Further, farther. Further, farther. Son lo mismo. Entendimos esta, esta cosa, que, que los irregulares no tienen regla a seguir. ¿Ok? Continuamos. What is common, teacher? What do you mean? A common, common, common adjective. Como los, los más comunes. Los más comunes, los, los activos más comunes, dice usted. Sí, gracias, gracias. Common, eh, common se pronuncia. Ah, this very common, common, common this adjective. Very common. Uh -huh, comunes, okay. los activos más comunes. That's why, estos son los irregulares más comunes. Hay otros, pero estos son los que se utilizan a diario. Good, better, but worse, little less, much more, far further, farther. ¿Ok? Ok, ok, muy bien. Ooh. And we finish, guys. Ooh. We finish section number two. So let's begin with number three. <laughs> so, el, el término de, la, de, de esto dice, describe what was learned during this section. ¿Qué aprendimos durante esta lección, guys? Um, Simple todo, pass. Todo, todo, todo así, cri, cri, cri. Simple pass, the simple pass, very good. Simple pass. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Um, adjective. 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 Mm -hmm. adjective. 
aprendimos sobre el tiempo, la hora, el día. Okay, very good. Okay. So, in the last one, how would you say the teacher presented this lesson's material? ¿Cómo presentó el material el, el profesor? Excel, excellent, very good, good, not bad, bad. Excelente, muy bien, bien, eh, no muy bien y mal. So, ¿cuál, cuál, cuál es eh, tu...? tu... Excelente, teacher. Excelente. Cinco estrellas. Uh, ya, 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 ya me... Ya Five stars. Ya me, ya me, ¿cómo es eso? Five stars. <laughs> Five stars, teacher. Ok, good. I like that, I like that. Ok, so, we finish this. Comencemos section number two. Que ahí tenemos algo bonito que aprender. Ok, let's begin. Okay, voy a abrir el archivo. Y como les ha gustado este formato... Y de igual forma lo continúe así, ¿ok? Sí, sección número 3. Here we go. And section 3 is What's your neighborhood like? Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Tell me. Dígame. Tengo una, lo diré en español. Tengo yeah. una duda. Mm -hmm. ¿Por qué cuando lee, por ejemplo, si la lección es 3.1, ¿por qué dice 3.1? ¿Y por qué cuando se da el correo electrónico se dice dot com? Porque en números es punto. Entonces es, es, es point en números. Por ejemplo, cuando estamos eh, hablando de dinero, uh, oh, eh, 3.25, 3 dólares y 25, ¿ya? Eh, en cambio, con el, el, el email, el email es específico para alfabético, no numérico. Entonces, por eso es que es that. ¿Quedó claro? Gracias. Yeah. So, cuando es algo numérico, vamos a utilizar punto. Y cuando es algo alfabético, um, es that. ¿Ok? No, ok. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, ¿Qué estaba haciendo? Me perdí. Ok, ya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> ya se le daba, venido, teacher. You're bad, you're bad. <laughs> uh, ya saben que yo me, eh, me, me emociono dando mi clase. Me emociona dar clases. I love it. I love it so much. Ok, guys, can you see this? ¿Ya lo pueden ver? Yes. Ok, so yes. we go to section number three. Section number three. And we start here. Ok, so what's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? ¿Todos? Ok. What's hey. your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? Y esta pregunta en español sería, ¿cómo es tu vecindario? ¿Cómo es tu vecindario? What's your neighborhood like? Neighborhood, vecindario. Neighbor. Neighborhood. Neighborhood. Neighbors. Neighborhood. 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 Very good. Let's go with that. Neighborhood. Achievement indicator, successfully identify, discuss, and talk about describing locations, asking about neighborhoods, asking about quantities. Quantities. Todos? Quantities. I tried to identify, No. Puede decir quantities o puede decir quantities. 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 Quantities.
introductions to vocabulary. So tenemos, number one, downtown. Todos, downtown. 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 Skyscraper. 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 No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. Skyscraper. Ownership. 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 Citizen. 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 Okay, downtown. The central area or commercial center of a town or city. Downtown. 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 Central area and a commercial center or town or leisure member of the city. Okay. Downtown, the central area or commercial center of the city. Downtown. 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 Sky with many stories. With many stories. With many stories. Ownership. Many stories. Being in possession of something. Ownership. Ownership. In possession of something. 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 Possession of something. Wait. Ownership. The state of being in possession of something. Ownership. Ownership. The state of being in possession of something. Something. Citizen. A native something. naturalized member of a state. Citizen, a native or naturalized member of a state. Member of a state. Member of a state. Member of a state. Citizen, a native or naturalized member of a state. Citizen, a native or naturalized member of a state. Naturalized member of a state. Okay, so this is the vocabulary to introduction. So downtown, ¿qué significa downtown según, según eso? Es el centro de la ciudad. Centro de la ciudad o el centro del pueblo. Skyscraper, ¿qué significa? Son varios eh, edificios. Donde hay edificios. Donde hay historia, sí. Sí. como el centro sí. histórico. No, 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 no. no, no. Cielo. 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 Ah. La definición dice... Un, un edificio muy alto con muchos con muchas historias no 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 historias sino que niveles ah, niveles o como le llamamos aquí, plantas plantas de muchas plantas plantas um, stories se refiere pisos. a las plantas o los pisos yes, yes. Mm. y ownership qué sería qué miedo ser, no, ser dueño, dueño, ah, ser dueño. Sí, propietario, sí. perdón. Propietario, sí. Ownership. Sí. Ownership, the state of being in possession, possession of... El dueño de algo. No, citizen. 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 Ah, donde viven los como los nativos, naturales. Es el ciudadano. Es el ciudadano. 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 Nativo o naturalizado de un okay. estado, una persona. Ciudadano. Very good. Okay. Ciudadano. Moving on. Teacher. Yeah. Sí. Teacher. What? Ahí en anterior yo tenía duda de be, bein, ¿cómo se pronunciaba? Bein. 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 No, no, bein. 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 Okay. 
Bien. 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 Okay. Let's practice. Let's practice. Uh, practiquemos con Bien. el vocabulario. Downtown has many things. Teacher, naturaliza y cómo se pronuncia. Downtown has many things to see. For example, the cathedral. Downtown has many things to see. For example, cathedral. 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 Dos o tres, está bien que lo, que lo repitan dos veces, está bien. Ok, downtown has many things to see. For example, the cathedral. Downtown, downtown has, has many, many things. things. The cathedral. For example, the cathedral. The cathedral. cathedral. cathedal. cathedral. Um, that skyscraper has a lot of stories. I think 102 in total. Okay. That's a lot of stories. I think a lot of stories. I think it's two in total. That skyscraper has a lot of stories. I think 102 in total. I have ownership of my car now since I finished paying for it. I have ownership of my car now since I finished paying for it. I have ownership of my car now since I finished paying for it. I have ownership of my car now since I finished paying for it. I have ownership of my car now Most of my family are U.S. citizens. 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 Citizens. Okay, let's move on. So let's go with 3.0. 3.0, achievement indicator. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation between neighbors asking about places in town. Pay attention to there is, there are, one, any, and some. So, in this session, we listen to a conversation between the neighbors asking about places in town. There is, there are, and so 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 there is, there are, how to make questions about there is or there are. Okay, vamos a hacer como se dice, allí hay, o allí no hay, o si hay ahí. Okay, let's go. Number one, who's that? 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 That is Jack, our new neighbor. That is Jack, our new neighbor. Or new neighbor. That is Jack, our new neighbor. That is Jack, our new neighbor. Our new neighbor. Where does he come from? 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 Just moving from New York City. Where does he come from? He has moved him from New York City. He just moved in from New York City. He just moved in from New York City. New York City. What does he do? 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 I think that he's a musician. 
I think that he is a musician. I think that he is a musician. I think that he is a musician. What is he looking for? 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 a grocery store. He is looking for a grocery store. He is looking for a grocery store. Very good. Any questions? Preguntas? Musician. Como... Musician. 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 What is the meaning of a grocery store, teacher? Grocery store? Tienda de grocery. Tienda de... No. no como grocery store es cuando, donde venden de golosinas, una tienda de golosinas. No, 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 no. No es Farmacia. Que, no, tampoco. Es donde venden eh, carne preparada. O comida preparada. Que ya solo van a para comer. Las grocery como, store. como un supermercado solamente Grocer, que la comida no, está no. medio preparada, sí. digamos. No, ya está preparada, solo es de traer comida chatarra. Comida. No, 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 comida no. rápida. No, no, no. Comida rápida. No, ese Burger King, eso no. Es comida ya preparada como <risa> deli. O sea, donde, donde venden ya comida, pero comida. No, 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 hamburguesas ni nada de eso. Ah, así pensado? como el deli arce. Bueno, más o menos, Com sí. Un comedor masivo. <risa> no, no es comedor porque no puede comer ahí. Solo es para, Ajá. Llevar. Solo es para Solo llevar. Solo es para llevar. Ok. Um, comida preparada, sí. empacada. Sí, sí, ya. Right. Um, vamos a ver dónde comenzamos. Ok. Um, Noé, who is that? Ok, Stephanie, who is that? That is Jack, our new neighbor. Ok, as Reina. Reina, where does... O oh, la misma pregunta? No, la siguiente, la siguiente. Ok, ok. Sorry. Reina, where does he come from? He just moved in from New York City. Okay, he just moved. Conté al final. He just moved from mm -hmm. New York City. He just moved. He just moved in from New York City. Okay, ask Maudi. Uh, Maudi, what does he do? I think that he is a musician. He is a, mu a musician. A musician. He is a musician. Okay. A Samuel. Samuel, yes. what is looking for? What is he looking for? He is looking for. He is looking for a grocery store. As Ninette. Ninette, who is that? That is Jack, our new neighbor. Uh, Sofia. Sofia, where does he come from? He just moved, moved in from New York City. No, 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 Sofia. He just moved in, moved in. He just moved in from New York City. Uh, he just moved in from... No, 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 no. Es que no diga moved. De un solo, pegue las dos. Move in, move in. He just uh, moved he in. Just from moving New from New York City. He just, moved in. he just moved in. He just moved in from New York City. Okay, Sofia, Janira. Janira, what does he do? I think that he is a musician. 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 We, musician. musician. Good. As Lisa. Lisa, what is he looking for? He is looking for a grocery store. Good. A Susan. Susan, who is that? Susan, who is that? <laughs> Susan, who is that? Okay, no, Susan. Maritza, who is that? What? That is Jack, our new neighbor. Thank you. Ask Ronald. Ronald, where does he come from? Uh, 
he he who's no, he just uh, he just moving in from New York City. As Angel. Angel, what does he do? I think that he a musician. That he is a musician. <laughs> He's a musician. Okay, as Felix. Felix, what is he looking for? He is looking for a grocery store. As Rocio. Uh, who is that? That is Jack, or new, new neighbor. As Nancy. Where does he come from? He just moved in from New York City. As Leticia. What does he do? Uh, I think uh, I think that he is a musician. As Fabricio. Fabricio, what is he looking for? He is uh, looking for for a grocery store. Good. As Rocio. Rocio, who is that? That is Jack, our new neighbor. Very good. Okay, guys, let's move on. Let's continue. And we get to 3.2, achievement indicator. In this session, participants will learn about how to ask and answer questions with this is, there are, one, any, some. Todos? In this session, In this session participants, participants, participants will learn, learn about how to ask and ask to ask, 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 is there a shopping mall near here? 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 Near near here. Near here. Near here. Near here. Near here. Near here. Yes, there are some. Metro Centro, Galerias, Multiplaza, and Soho. Yes, Is there a church near here? 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 No, the reason the closest is in downtown. No, there isn't. The closest is in downtown. No, no, no. there isn't. The closest is in downtown. Are there any barber shops around here? Are there any barber shops around here? Any barber shops around here? Are there any um, barber shops around here? Are there any barber shops around here? 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 No, there aren't any, but there are some beauty salons. No, 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 there aren't any, any there but are there are some, some beauty salons. Some beauty salons. No, there aren't any, but there are some beauty salons. No, there aren't any, but there are some beauty salons. Are there any casinos around this neighborhood? 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 Yes, there is one in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Yes, there is one in Antiguo Yes, there is one in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Yes, there is one in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Good. Yes, there is one. There is one. Okay, listen. Um, si se fijan, la mayoría dice near here o around here. Entonces, cerca de aquí o por aquí. 
Near significa cerca y la otra es around. Around here. O por aquí. Ok. Alrededor. Ok, yeah, around here, alrededor de aquí. Ok, let's go practice. ¿Alguien tiene el proyecto muy alto? Estoy oyendo noticias. <laughs> ok, let's start with Fabricio. Fabricio, is there a shopping mall near here? Yes, there are some metro centro, galerías, multiplaza, and so on. Ok, uh, Fabricio, as um, Leticia. Leticia, is there a church near here? No, there isn't. The closest is in downtown. As Maritza. Maritza, are there any barber shops around here? No, there aren't any, but there are some beauty salons. Good. As Samuel. Samuel, are there any casinos around this neighbor? neighborhood? Neighborhood. This neighborhood? Yes, there, there is one in Antigua Cusca Plaza. Good. As Ninette. Ninette, is there a shopping mall near here? Ninette, is there a shopping mall near here? Okay, Nancy, is there a shopping mall near here? Yes, there are some. Metro Centro, Galerías, Multiplaza, and Soho. Thank you. As Rocio. Is there a chur church near here, Rocio? No, there isn't. The closest is in downtown. Good. As Ronald. Ronald, are there any barbershops around here? No, they aren't any, but there are some beautiful salons. Beauty, no, no beautiful. Beauty. 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 Good. As Salud. Angel. Angel, are there any casinos around this neighborhood? Yes, there is one in Antiguo Cusca Plan. Good. As Susan. Susan, is there a shopping mall in here? Susan, are you here? Are you here? Yes, she's here, but I think she's having trouble with the microphone. Susan, can you hear us? Susan? Okay, definitely, she has problems with, with the microphone. Okay, Angel, as Lisette. said. Lisette, is there a shopping mall near here? Yes, there are some Metro Centro Galerias, Multiplaza, and Soho. Thank you, as Janira. Janine, is there a shower near here? No, there isn't. The closet is in downtown. Good. Ask Elam. Elam, are there any barbershops around here? No, there aren't any, but there are some pure salon. Good. Ask Sophia. Are there any people around the neighborhood? No, I go. Are there any casinos around this neighborhood? Yes, they are one in Antiguo Cuscatlán. Thank you. Ask Flor. Uh, Flor, is there a shopping mall near here? No, there isn't. The closet is in downtown. Thank you. Ask Reina. Are there any barber shop around here? No, there aren't any but there are some beauty salons. Thank you, as Stephanie. Are there any casinos around the, this neighborhood? Yes, there is one in Antiguo Cuscatlán. As Maudi. Hi Maudi, is there a shopping mall near here? Yes. There are some Metro Centro Galerias, Multiplaza, and Soho. Good. As Noé. Noé, is there a church near here? Noé? Mm. 
Okay, Noé, no listen. No listen, Noé. No listen, Noé. Okay, Maudi, <laughs> ask Carlos René, please. Carlos, is there a church near here? No, there isn't. This class is in the town, downtown. Thank you very much. Okay, let's move on. Ya le pregunté a todos, creo. Okay, let's go. So, 3.5, I should be an indicator. In this session, participants will follow a conversation about a, a neighborhood taking into account questions like how many, how much, with quantifiers. Todos? In this session, participants will follow a conversation about a neighborhood about into a common question like how many, how many, how many, many, with quantifiers, quantifiers. 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 So, ya aquí ya nos vamos acercando a lo que va a ser eh, la, la gramática con quantifiers. Con quantifiers vamos a tener gramática, ¿ok? So, let's go. Que son quantificadores, ¿ok? Quantifiers. Quantifiers. Ok. How do you like your new apartment? How do you like, How do you like, you like your new apartment? apartment? Do you, how do you like your new apartment? 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 I love it. I love it. It's close to my job and the neighbors are friendly. I love it. It's close to my job and the neighbors are friendly. I love it. It's close to my job and the neighbors are friendly. I love, I love it. it. It's close to my job. Close to my job. Oh, oh, and the neighbors are friendly. friendly. I don't like it very much. It's a noisy neighborhood. I don't, I don't like, like it very much. It's a noisy neighborhood. It's a noisy neighborhood. Where is it located? 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 Where is Located a Colonia Flor Blanca next to Mágico González Stadium. Located a Colonia Flor Blanca next to Mágico González Stadium. Located a Colonia Flor Blanca next to Mágico González Stadium. Located a Colonia Flor Blanca next to Mágico González Stadium. How many restaurants are there near your place? How many, How many restaurants many are there near, 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 near your place? place? How, How place? many restaurants are there near your place? How many restaurants are there near your place? There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, and a China Restaurant. It's called China Garden. There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro. Hola, restaurant. China Restaurant. Hola, China Garden. China Garden. China. No, no, it's China Garden. China Garden. China, China, China Garden. China Garden. There are many. There is Don, there is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, and a China Restaurant is called China Garden. There are many. There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, a China Restaurant, China Garden. China Garden. China Garden. No, no, digan is called. Is called. It's called, 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 no, not at all. There are three different stations or not not around. No, not at all. Since there are three different police stations all around. No, not at all. There are three different police stations all around. There are three different police stations all around. All around. I made a mistake. Cometí un error aquí. 
¿Cuál era? 3.6. ¿Cuál era? 3.5. No. 3.5. Sí, por... 3.5. Sí, por... Next. Esta es ya. Esta es la que estamos leyendo. Yes, teacher. Chinese. Chinese restaurant. Ok, aquí está. Chinese restaurant. Chinese restaurant. Chinese. 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 What is the difference Chinese in China? Yeah, es uh, su, su, um, su gentilicio. gentilicio. My bad. Okay. Chinese. Yeah, there are many, uh, solo la palabra es Chinese restaurant. Chinese restaurant. What Chinese is prime, teacher? Huh? What is prime? Delincuencia. Prime. De, uh, crimen. Crimen. No delincuencia. Crimen. crimen. Okay. Science. Crimen. Since. No, since. no since. not at all. Since there are three different police. Not at all. This is since desde since que hay tres, tres estaciones de policías. Not at all. Y noisy es ruidoso. Ruidoso. Noisy. 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 Que dije que era since. Crimen. Desde. Delincuencia. Desde. No. Desde. 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 Ah, sí, desde. Okay. ¿Qué? ¿Qué? ¿La que preguntó Angel? ¿Cuál? Uh, crime. Crime. crime, crime, crimen, crimen, crime. Ah, crime. Dice, ¿cómo se decía? No, 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 at all. Not at all, 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 not at all. Teacher, what is the correct pronoun? Signs. 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 La pronunciación de different, different. ¿Cuál, cuál, 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 cuál? Different. ¿Dónde, dónde está? ¿Y cuál? La última. La última línea. Different. Oh, different. Yeah. different. Not at all, since there are three different. 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 Ok, good. Different. Ok, different. El... Let's practice, let's practice. Ok, wait, 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 let me put it here. Ok, um... Donde comienzo. Uh, Carlos René, how do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's close to my job in neighbors in Finley. I don't like it very much. It's a noise neighborhood. Noisy, noisy neighborhood. Noisy neighborhood. Okay, as Maudi. As Maudi. Okay, Ma uh, Maudi, where is it located? Ah, it's located at Colonia Flor Blanca next to Magico Gonzalez Stadium. Okay, as Stephanie. Stephanie, how many restaurants are there near your place? Stephanie? Okay. Reina, how many restaurants are there near your place? There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, and a Chinese restaurant. It's called Chinese, Chinese, Chinese China. Garden. China Garden. China Garden. It's cold. It's cold. It's it cold. cold. It's cold. Okay, it's cold. Uh, ask Ninette. Ninette, can you speak? Ninette? Ninette? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Sorry, repeat, please. Is there much crime? No, not at all. Since there are three different police stations around. Since. 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 Good. No, Let's explore, please. Ninette, explore. 
Minette as Flor. Flor, who do you like your new apartment? How? How do you like? How do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's close to my home. How, your to my job. And the, neighbor, and the neighbor are friendly. I don't like it very much. It's a noise neighborhood. Noisy. 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 Good. As 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 Lee said. Where is the located? He, it is located at Colonia Florida next to Mexico Gonzalez Stadium. Good. As Janira. Janira, how many restaurants are there near your place? There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, and a China. Chinese, restaurant. Chinese, Chinese, Chinese. Chinese restaurant is called China Garden. Very good. Uh, Susan. Susan, is there much crime? Susan? Okay, no, as Angel then. Angel, Angel, is there much crime? Uh, no, not at all. Since there are three different police stations all around. Since, since. Since. Mm -hmm. Since there are three different police stations mm -hmm. all around. Since. 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 Since there are three different police stations all around. Good, good. Es que estaba diciendo <laughs> sin. Sin es pecado. Ojo, pecado es sin. Pecador, pecador. I have a question. Yeah. <laughs> este. Dice que yo, bueno, lo voy a decir en español. Yo digo que... <laughs> Yo algo que algunos dicen, bueno, restaurant, y otros dicen restaurant. ¿Cuál es el correcto pronombre? Depende, recuerda lo que le dije de que depende ah, de dónde viva. Entonces, de algunos, algunos van a tener un sonido más fuerte, depende de, de cómo hablen ellos ahí, en la ciudad. Restaurant, restaurant. Y otros van a decir restaurant. So, van a oír tres diferentes sonidos. Por ejemplo, en Washington dicen restaurant. Restaurant. Casi no se oye en la A. En Nueva York va a decir restaurant. Restaurant. Y ya más arriba, como, como en, en New Jersey, va a decir restaurant. Restaurant. So, depende del área donde viva la gente. Yeah. Ok. Um, ok, Angel, ask Leticia. Leticia, how do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's close to me, Joe, and the neighbor are friendly. I don't like it very much. It's a noisy neighborhood. Okay, Leticia, it's close to my job. To my job. Usted dijo me. My it's job. close to my job. Very In good. the neighbor uh, are friendly. Good. Ask Ronald. Ronald, where is located? Where is it? Where is it located? Where is it located? Where is it located? It's located at Colonia for Blanca next to Magico Gonzalez Stadium. Good. Ask Felix. Felix, how many restaurants are the near your place? There are many. There is Cafe Don Pedro, La Casona Restaurant, and a uh, Chinese. Chinese restaurant is called China China Garden. China Garden. A Rocío. Um, a quién? A Rocío. Rocío, is there much crime? No, not all. Sin chi are. Ah, no, sin. There are chi. Rocío, sins. No, not all. Sins. There are three different police stations or around. Good. Ask Fabricio. How do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's close to my job and the neighbor are friendly. I don't like it very much. It's a noisy neighborhood. Ask Maritza. Maritza, where is locator? Where is it? Where is, where is it? it? Where is it? Where, where is it? Where is it located? It's located at Colonia Flor Blanca next to Magico Gonzalez Stadium. 
Very good. ¿A quién no le hemos preguntado? Ya le preguntamos a todos, sí. A mí, teacher. ¿Quién es mi? Samuel. Samuel, Samuel. ok. Uh, ¿Quién contestó de último? Pregúntele a Samuel, please. Maritza. Maritza. Samuel, how many restaurants are there near your place? There are many. There, there is Café Don Pedro, La Cajona Restaurant, and I, China's Restaurant. It's called China Garden. Chinese, Chinese restaurant. Chinese, Chinese restaurant. Very good. Ok, ya ven por qué el teacher está gordito, porque está rodeado de, de, de puro restaurante. <laughs> Y hay muchos más. Hay si ahí los que son los que están en mi cuadra. Eh, en el cuadro, los que están en mi cuadra. Ok, guys. Uh, that was the class for tonight. Esta fue la clase de, de la noche de hoy. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Espero que lo hayan disfrutado como yo. Me emociono. Miren, ya me pasé para la otra clase. Pero igual, me gusta, me gusta lo que hago. Ya me dio hambre. Me too. Forever gordito. <risa> Teacher, I am hungry. Me too, me too. Ya somos dos. Nice up too. Ok, guys. La otra clase dice a comer, pa. No, todavía no. Okay. La clase de la comida. Okay. Oh, good night, guys. Good night, teacher. Good, good night, night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Tomorrow. Always nice to see you, okay? Okay. Bye, everyone. Nice to see you. Nice to nice see to you. See you. Have, have a good nice night. to see you. And sleep like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll see you tomorrow, guys. See you tomorrow, teacher. Thank you. Have a nice night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, Felix.